When drivers are in an area where they see a bus, that means they're students. So you can look at them for stops, um, pay attention to the lights, and limit their distractions. If it's a two-lane road, you have to stop for the school bus, you cannot go around. Once that stop sign comes out as a legal stop sign, you may not pass the bus. If it's on a four-lane road, if you're on the same traffic way as the school bus, you have to stop. If you are the opposite traffic way, you must slow down and be aware that there are students in the area, but you may continue safely. We have a good rapport with our bus drivers. If the violation is observed, they contact Kersler Police Division and we will do an investigation. And in the state of Ohio, a bus violation is a mandatory court appearance. Students should always approach the bus with caution, look both ways, especially when crossing, but also entering the bus because it's very common to have drivers come up the right side now. Even though you have curbside pickup and drop offs, we try to limit the crossing, you still want to proceed with caution. For teen drivers, put down your phone, both hands on the wheel, and pay attention to the road and your surroundings. The number one uh, fatality rate amongst teens is motor vehicle accidents. So anything we can do to prevent that, we will. Reduce distractions, that includes cell phones, that includes Starbucks, that includes your friend in the back seat, that's back seat driving. Make sure you're paying attention to one thing, and that's being safe on the road. As far as the drivers go, I try and make myself very visible out there. I want the drivers to see me. I want them to know that it's the time of day when kids are going to be crossing the streets and that they've got to take a little bit of extra care. Pay attention to the flashing lights. It's 20 miles an hour, not 35. The students, I want them to be aware that the safest place to cross is where the crossing guard is. Don't cross a block down because you won't have to get off your bike that over there. It's not safe. The second thing is crossing with a bicycle. Please walk your bikes across the street. The same thing with the walkers. You have to look left, right, left before you cross. A lot of times vehicles don't see you. A lot of times people don't see you. Safety first.